Game day. <laughs> Cheers, mate. Cheers. <laughs> Hey everybody, it's good to have you guys back again. Thanks for tuning in to another vlog of mine. This is gonna be our very last match in the 2022-2023 season. Calling it the last dance or the last ride, you can say, because it'll also be my very last game here as the head coach leading the Northeastern men's soccer program. I've accepted another position, college coaching position elsewhere. Very excited to end this chapter here. It's been a bittersweet journey, so many ups and downs and great memories, but that's besides the point. We'll talk about those details in another video another time but right now just focused on the day we're playing the Colorado Rush Academy uh, I believe it'll be their under 18s it is currently noon we'll be leaving and hit the road by two so in two hours we'll we'll head down that way been a crazy year and uh, yeah we just want to end it off on a good note but most importantly it's just kind of going back to the rest of the season and just learning to appreciate everything that's went on. Quite ready, happy to go, and uh, kind of sad at the same time. A lot of mixed emotions. I think you guys know what this game means. It's it's the last one we get to go together. It's the last ride and there, enjoy yourself though. So. It's all about the performance. The result will come by itself. First five minutes, first clean tackles ours. We gotta set the tone.
Hello everybody, now we're towards the end of this video. Before I get into anything, I'd like to say thank you for tuning in once again. It took me a little while to record this because of how hard it was for me to not want things to come to an end. As I mentioned earlier in the video, this is my last ever game as the head coach for the Northeastern Men's Soccer Program. And although it was an exhibition match, it makes it still very, very difficult and hard with me being with this specific program and working with these boys. This experience has taught me so much and this is the program where I came in as a young 23 year old individual. Lost, not sure what to do or what to expect, but I just took it day by day and embraced everything that came my way. Through all the ups and the downs, I wouldn't have had it any other way. And boy, there was so many downs as much as there were the ups. A big thing that I did realize is the people that you meet along the way that make the journey so much more special. And I'm so happy to have came across so many great individuals within, within my student athletes, colleagues, and friends that I've made here. It means so much to have been able to lead this program for the past two years. And now I leave as a 25 year old with so much more experience. I can't wait to share with you guys my next steps and the next chapter that I will be pursuing. Be sure to be on the lookout for that in the next video. Without further ado, I did want to share with you guys about the match. We played the Colorado Rush. It was a young group, but it was a great way for us to have one last match, but also be able to evaluate the young up and coming prospects. The match did end 5 0. We ended up scoring off of three set pieces, which is something we're very happy about. Set pieces is something that we take a lot of pride in and work a lot on. It's kind of the name of the game in college. It doesn't matter how dominant you are, how much you can keep the ball, sometimes a match can come down to one set piece goal. And honestly, that's just the reality of college soccer. It has been my honor to be the coach for the Northeastern Men's Soccer Program, and I'll forever be thankful for this experience. Be sure to look out for upcoming videos. I'll probably do a house tour. I will also be sharing with you guys the next program that I will be going to continue coaching at. Oh, 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 oh,